Good evening. I'd like to bring the reorganization meeting for the Interboro School District Board of School Directors to order. Um, Mrs. Caldwell, may I have a roll call, please? Mr. Eckert? Here. Mr. Evans? Here. Mrs. Lloyd? Here. Mr. Razzi? Here. Mr. Phelps? Here. Mr. Harris? Here. Mrs. DiBattista? Here. Mrs. Kurduski? Here. Mrs. Talker? Here. Heavenly Father, please hear our prayer. Bless all schools, colleges, and especially the Edinburgh School District, and grant to this board in the deliberations this evening the spirit of wisdom, truth, and knowledge. What is undertaken always be done in, clarity, in charity and in peace, and what we do might be for the benefit of others. All this we ask in your name. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We're going to move to public comments. Um, I'm going to ask the audience that the notice of the reorganization meeting. I'm sorry, Ms. Kurjewski. This is just a reading of the notice that went into the newspaper for the reorganization meeting. It was published on Monday, November 24th in the Delaware County Times. In the Barrow School District public meeting of the Board of School Directors, there will be a board reorganization meeting of the Edinburgh Board of School Directors on Monday, December 1, 2014 at 6 p.m. in the multi-purpose room of the Kindergarten Academy in the Administration Building 900 Washington Avenue. Prospect Park, PA 19076, Board of School Directors. Thank you. We'll move on to the public comments. Uh, the first public comment section would be for agenda items only. If you come to the microphone, please identify yourself and give us your address. No takers. We'll move on to the election of a temporary president. I'd like to call for nom nominations for a temporary president. I nominate Ann. Mrs. Kurdzewski's name has been entered in uh, nomination. We don't need a second. Are there any additional nominations for temporary president? President. I have a motion to close with nominations. Motion to close. Motion to close, and we'll elect the temporary pre uh, president, Mrs. Kurdzewski. All in favor, please say aye. Uh, Second? Second by Mr. Phelps. Mr. Phelps, sorry, Mr. Phelps. All those in favor of Ms. Krajewski as temporary president, please say yes. 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 Ms. Krajewski. Thank you. First order of business this evening is the election of president to serve from December 1, 2014 until the reorganization meeting to be held during the first week in December 2015 under Section 404 of the Pennsylvania School Code. I'd like to open the floor for nominations for president. I'd like to nominate Mrs. Kathleen Hogger for president. Okay, we have Mrs. Hogger nominated. Do I hear any other nominations for president? Motion to close nominations. Motion. Second. Okay, at this time, all in favor of electing Mrs. Kathy Hogger as school board president for this coming, coming year, please say yes. 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 All opposed? The motion here is 9-0. Thank you, Ms. Krajewski. And I thank the board um, for um, their support this past year. Um, we've been a team. I think that we've moved the district forward uh, quite a bit. A lot of major projects. Um, we have cleaned up our policies, which is something we've been trying to work on for the past two years. So I appreciate their help and support, and I certainly need their help and support in the coming years. So thank you very much. Um, I'd like to move on for, to the election of Vice President to serve from December 1st, 2014 until the reorganization meeting to be held during the first week of December 2015 according to Section 404 of the Pennsylvania School Code. Could I have any nominations for School Board Vice President? I'd like to nominate Brian Razzi. Mr. Razzi's name has been placed in nomination. Any additional nominations? I'd like to nominate Paul Ecker. 
Mr. Eckert's name has been entered into um, nomination for vice president. Any additional? Hearing none. Um, I could wait about Mrs. Palmer. Yes, Mr. Eckert. Although I appreciate uh, Mr. Lowell Eddie's uh, nomination there, I would like to withdraw my name, please. That's possible. Thank you. Mr. Eckert has withdrawn his name. Um, any additional nominations? Mrs. Potter? Yes, Mr. Evans. That being the case, I'd like to nominate myself for vice president. Um, Mr. Evans has entered his name in nomination for vice president. Any additional nominations for vice president? Hearing none, I need a motion to close nomination. Motion to close. Second. Second for Ms. Krajewski. Uh, Ms. Caldwell, could we have a roll call vote? Could each board member state which candidate they would like to support for vice president? Mr. Eckert? Mr. Razzi? Mr. Evans? Jack Evans. Mrs. Foy? Mr. Razzi. Mr. Razzi? Mr. Razzi. Mr. Phelps? Mr. Razzi. Mr. Harris? Mr. Razzi. Mrs. DiBattista? Mr. Razzi. Mrs. Krajewski? Mr. Razzi. Mrs. Hawker? Mr. Razzi. Congratulations, Mr. Razzi. Thank, thank, you. thank you, Mr. Evans, for putting your name forward. Uh, um, shall we move on to naming of the solicitor, Section 406, uh, Pennsylvania School Code? Ms. Krajewski, please. Motion to appoint the law firm of Raphael Acupio as solicitor for Inverse School District at an annual retainer of $2,000 and at an hourly rate of $185. And to appoint the law firm of Eckert Seaman as solicit solicitor for labor issues at an hourly rate of $250. These appointments will be in effect from December 1, 2014 until the reorganization meeting to be held during the first week of December 2015. Second. It's been moved and seconded. Are there any questions or comments from board members concerning the appointment of our solicitor? Hearing none, all those in favor, please say aye. Aye. Opposed? Motion carries going zero. Motion 10, please. Ms. Krajewski. Motion that the beneficial bank be named depository for school district funds for a period extending from December 1. 2014 until the reorganization meeting to be held during the first week of December 2015. Second. It's been moved and seconded for our depository for uh, school funds. Are there any questions or comments from school board members? Hearing none, all those in favor, please say aye. Aye. Opposed? Motion carries 9-0. Motion 11, please. Motion that the following schedule of board meetings to begin at 7 p.m. and the meetings will be conducted in the high school auditorium, 16th and Amos Lane Road, Prospect Park, PA, or any facility in the Inverse School District be approved as listed. Second. It's been moved and seconded. Questions or comments from board members? Hearing none, all those in favor, please say aye. 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 Opposed? Motion carries 9-0. We'll move to the second public comment section. Um, this can be uh, public comments on any matter. Having no takers, um, let us go to uh, Mrs. Riley. Any comments? Uh, I would just like to congratulate you and Mr. Razzi, and I look forward to another productive year working with the board and the administrative team. Any other comments from board members? We can pass you the microphone. Announcements. There will be an executive session held immediately after the adjournment of tonight's meeting. The next work session of the Interborough Board of School Directors will be convened in the boardroom of the administration building on Monday, December 15, 2014 at 6.30 p.m. The next regular monthly public meeting of the Interborough Board of School Directors will be convened in the auditorium of the Interborough High School on Wednesday, December 17, 2014 at 7 o'clock p.m. Meetings adjourned. Thank you.